Right now, we are in our first intermission. We want to welcome in a special guest here to the broadcast booth as uh, the Ferris State Bulldogs lead Alabama Huntsville one and nothing after the first 20 minutes. Joining us is Tony Anise, head football coach here at Ferris State. And coach, thanks for taking the time to join us here. Nice to see you at a hockey game. Yeah, thanks. Uh, big recruiting day for us, so we're running around all over the place trying to get a few more guys to be Bulldogs. Yeah, I'm sure a lot of people think of it as the end of the season. You know, the season's over, but for you guys, not much downtime because this is, as you said, very, very important with the recruiting. Yeah, the season ends for us February 3rd, and uh, so once, uh, you know, play ends uh, on the field, you know, we're on the road recruiting like crazy. We don't have a dead period like Division One has, so we are able to recruit all the way through the holidays, and uh, so it's uh, just a big process. You know, obviously it's a big part of what you want to do to be a, a successful team is to get uh, great student athletes here. So going back to this past football season, another successful regular season for you guys, and uh, Jason Vanderlaan, a second consecutive Harlan Hill Trophy, and I can tell you're missing him a lot right now, and maybe just uh, hey, give us some thoughts about Jason Vanderlaan and uh, how you're feeling about having to move on without him. Yeah, you know, I, I guess uh, that was going to happen eventually. Um, it hasn't happened uh, for me at Fair State. I haven't taken the field there without him next to me, and, and so it's going to be a challenge for sure. Um, you know, it's hard to fill the void of a, a great player, let alone a great leader and a person that represents the institution in such a positive way. So uh, just an incredible young man. Um, I feel blessed to have the opportunity to, to coach him over the last four years. And uh, we lost, a, you know, lost a good one there. We lost Justin Zimmer, who's a, another good one. Both of them uh, have chances to be in the NFL. And so we're proud of that. And, you let people go and hope for the best and uh, hope that the guys we have on campus can fill that void. Speaking here with Tony and East, head coach of Ferris State Football. After one period, Bulldogs on top of Alabama Huntsville, one to nothing. And we talk about Alabama Huntsville. Well, you were just in Alabama, and we talked about Jason Vanderlaan, but I'm sure that was really special getting to go down there again and, and be there for the Harlan, Harlan Hill Trophy presentation. Yeah, you know, it's... Uh, it's amazing, you know, I've been a Division II coach for four years, and I guess 50% of the time my guys <laughs> won the Harlan Hill. So uh, pretty incredible considering the fact there's only been four GLIAC guys, you know, that well, three that won the four years, the three guys, Jason's two of them, and then, um, you know, Joyke Bell, obviously, who was in the NFL, and uh, Cullen Finnerty from, uh, from Grand Valley. So, you know, it's been an incredible deal for him, and, you know, we're proud of uh, – proud of him and yeah going into Huntsville it's like you know just down there last week flew in and and uh, had a great opportunity to be in Florence for the ceremony they have a great banquet there and the people of Florence uh, you know love the opportunity to still be connected with the, the Hill Trophy. All right last thing here we, we can't go without letting you talk about the spring game because it's actually not that far away when you look at the calendar uh, when is the spring spring game going to be and when do you guys start up with the spring practices you know that's a good question the date um, <laughs> I would have to look at my calendar right now it's not in my head but uh, spring practices start the Friday after spring break after I come back from spring break so I think it's like March 18th um, and then we roll through spring ball and and the spring game will be another opportunity for us to get together and and hopefully it'll be warm and it'll be exciting but uh, you know, spring is going to be a big spring for us because there's still going to be so many, uh, you know, just a quarterback alone, you know, putting him and, uh, you know, putting the guys that we have in, in those spots to try to get uh, our program, you know, our offense particularly be successful. And, and then, you know, we had a great group of uh, freshmen last year that none of them, all of them redshirted. So uh, this will be their time to shine and give a chance to show how good they are. That's Tony and East, head coach for Ferris State Football. Congratulations on a great season GLIAC title, second GLIAC title in a row, and yeah. uh, thanks for joining us here in the first intermission. Thanks, guys. I appreciate you guys having me.